and today I'm going to be reviewing the John Deere Quick Trap 636M. It's 36 inch. Um, okay, so I'm going to start out with the things I don't like on it. So, one of the things I don't really like about it, this machine, is the suspension platform is when you're when you're going with the blades on and it's bouncy you bounce and you're bouncing up and down is the whole whole machine will like either turn off if you're off for a while, if you're like up for a while on a big bump or like sputter like um another thing I don't like is the fixed deck I wish it had a floating deck on it, but it doesn't. Um, those are really the main things I really don't like. There's not too much but the machine I don't like. Mainly, it's a really good machine. Um, but I wish I wish this right here would stay up, but it doesn't. So you have to use a bungee cord or something of that nature to keep it up. Um, okay, so the things I do like about it, uh, the speed can go up to 8 miles an hour, which is it's a pretty good speed for it. Uh, it has a John Deere 18.5 horsepower engine. It's a pretty powerful engine. It's basically a Kawasaki FS 600V engine. Basically, just a John John Deere version, but it's pretty pretty good size horsepower and good, pretty good size um, uh, air filter. But the one thing I wish is the uh, um I don't have the muffler right now or the uh, muffler cover on it right now. But I do like. This, on um, most of 36 inch, these right here are not equal. Ones might be like right here, other might be like way over here. That's one thing I do like, it's equal. So like when you're turning, it might help a little. Um, It has the, so, and the suspension, suspension, so it has the springs. And then underneath it, down here, it has it has these things right here, these black things, but they're really good suspension when you're going down. Um, so it it won't be it won't it won't be very um stiff. It's pretty nice, pretty bouncy. Um, down here we have got your transmissions right here. Um, you got a. It tells you this um, note tells you daily service you do. It's pretty nice to have because if you take this cover off, you can see down here. You got your belts for your deck belts, which is pretty easy to get to. Pretty simple. Just take the cover off real fast. Just screw this back on. It's pretty simple to do. It's one thing I like about it, it's very simple. Not very hard. Um, uh, uh, you got your um, electrical stuff right here, and you got some up there too. With the main two over right here, um, simple stuff. You got your parking brake right there. You got your deck adjustments. And I like about what I, another thing I like about this machine is right here the bar, level bars. Most of them, one of like one of these will be sticking up out here, so you have to push it in. And if you let if you 
let go and it comes back out, it'll turn the machines on if the blades are on. That's one thing I like about it. Um, you got your choke right here, your speed, and I like the little blade, the little switch. Instead, normally it's like this, up and down, but I like that. Um, you got your key, normal, you got your hour meter, I got 10 hours on it right now. Um, but in another thing I like, gas tank, it, it lasts a pretty long while. It's only 5.5 .5 gallons, but it still lasts a good amount. It has a fuel gauge, which I love. Um, right now, almost full. And it has this left this switch right lever right here. If you want, if you want to turn the gas off or on, pretty nice. Um, um, it has two 18 inch blades, which is pretty nice. Uh, another thing I like uh, is the deck. It goes from one and a half inches all the way to, what's that right now? I think it's five, five inches. Um, so I know on some others, it might go from two inches up to four. So it gives you like an extra inch and an extra, extra inch higher and a half an inch lower. So that's pretty nice. You got um, more height to choose from. Um, another thing, the, uh, what was it? I don't think of anything I forgot. Oh, the uh, wheelie wheels right here, really nice. They have these on the right mowers too. But it's really nice. So if like you're on a hill, and somehow the mower tips back, it won't. It'll keep it from being a bad, a bad accident. It'll keep it up. It won't flip over. So it's pretty nice. It'll hit the ground. Um. Another thing I like about this machine is. Um. The um, battery is pretty good. The battery is a 12 volt, 12 volt battery. Um, the tires are actually pretty good size too, for for a 36 inch one. They're 18 inches or Turf Master wheels. Um, the front or the caster wheels are. They are I think 11 inches. Another thing I like about. The wheels in the front, they 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 don't take air, so they won't you won't have to fill them up with air, and they won't pop if anything happens. Pretty nice. Um, you got your deck belt right there. You can see from the front. You can take take this part right here off, and then you can get you to your deck easier. Um. Another thing that I like about this mower is it had its um is that like I said before the engine I like it because even it's a John Deere but I like it a lot because it's basically just a Kawasaki sounds the same basically the same thing. As the FS engine. Um, reverse speed is three and a half miles, like I said, Ford's eight miles. Has a two year warranty, which is a pretty good warranty on it. But overall, I love this mower. Um, it weighs about 731 pounds with the fuel, fuel and oil full. So and it's very balanced. I like that about most stand on mowers, specifically this one. Like when you're going up a hill, it's very balanced. Like the walk behinds is not very balanced. When you're going uphill, the front will lift up and do like a wheelie. And that's why in here you have the wheelie wheels too. But it's very balanced. It should never flip because it's so balanced. Um, the. Feel, it's a, a two-cylinder V-twin, it's pretty nice. Um, it has, 
3600 RPM. It's pretty good RPM for it. For a 36 inch stand on. But that's really it for today's review of the John Deere 636M 36 inch quick trip. See you next time.